Welcome to Team Sports Entertainment, your one-stop shop for mature dialogue. We're going to get right to it. Welcome to Team Sports Entertainment, the podcast, your one-stop shop for mature sports dialogue. I am your host, Earl Tima, alongside my co-host, my big on Alan Tima. Before we go any further, don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, hit the notification bell. That way you know when we upload new content and leave some comments below. We appreciate it. We're getting right to it. Los Angeles Lakers news AD is out for an additional three weeks and uh no need to worry championship team they're gonna do it by what what we're we gonna do it by by committee by committee that and that's the thing I'm, I've been you said relax who you talking to relax because the, the the Laker fans I'm reading I'm reading I'm reading everything that you guys say when you, you y'all want to trade everybody for everybody that making 30 million <laughs> you, we, listen we don't need all of that they they got it they we had one of the best free uh, uh over the summer we signed a lot of we we we, we put people in there of the course Warriors. we're missing i believe we're missing uh, uh of course dwight and and mcgee i believe that yeah and i would love to see rondo i would love to see a lot of things but let's deal with what we have what the lakers have if they do it by committee, they can hold it off. And if that's the good thing about it. Because not just doing it by committee, because the chemistry that they can get going before A D get back and when and just to get better as a team. And then when a, you plug in a piece like A D into a team it's listen, all things work together for the good. Mm. AD needed a rest. I'd rather for it to have been happening now than later on, and now we're going into playoffs without him. This is the way it's supposed to be. The man upstairs got the Lakers. All right, that, that sounds good, man. Um, like you said, they, they just need probably an additional big with or without AD. Yeah, I mean, but, I for still the final think stretch. Gonna, yeah, I think they're going to make, make a. a a, it's a, a trade. A, there's going to be something added to the team. Mm-hmm. We know that, but we don't have to rush. Nah, it's, it's not. Nah. And, and if you look at it, the upcoming uh, schedule, like the next four games, is favorable. And you have other teams that are struggling right now. I think they looked at that as well. Like, you know what? We can just stay in the top three for the next three weeks. Then we, you know, I'm not even worried about it. I'm not as long as they, unless they they falling out of the playoffs. But my point is, by committee. I believe they could do it. They can do it and shock everybody. And, of course, we know what that's going to do. That's going to say that's going to make LeBron the MVP because he's doing it without Anthony Davis. But Trez is only going to get better by getting more minutes and getting a better chemistry with Schroeder. And and, and then Kuz, if Kuz can get into a nice rhythm and make it hard, for you not to put him on the floor mm-hmm. and the way he's playing he, the game has really slowed down yeah, for real. he's not trying to score every time he get the ball so if Kuzma can come in and still just be that energy guy and and get buckets yeah. but see the difference between him getting buckets now in the last few games he's not forcing anything he's allowing it to come Get some easy buckets too, transition, offensive rebounds. But I like how you mentioned Trez too. Like this may sound crazy. A D being out, hopefully. I'm I'm hoping that it gives Trez some more defensive reps. Yeah. Because that's what he he gonna get his points. Mm-hmm. Defensively is what I need him working on. Yeah. But he's getting better. He is because if you look at um couple of the last games down the stretch, he's act he normally doesn't play down the stretch. Mm-hmm. Now Anthony Davis not there. He's playing down the stretch, and he's playing solid defense. I mean, some the the last game they played against um, Indiana. Indiana yeah. I mean, he he was right there with the defensive rotations. That's what I mean. If he get his rotations down pat without Anthony Davis, when Anthony Davis come back, that's less for him to cover up. Mm-hmm. So I yeah, mean, the, and, and, and with all of this, and, and with all of this, that it, where it seems. Because people are panicking. Even the, even the non-Laker fans that want to see them, they, they're they so anxious that, oh, they're through, they're through. But they're still right there. 
they're still right there. Three games out of first place. Yeah, and 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 uh, and it's it's great. I don't think they have like Braun gonna have to go into like a to win an MVP mode Mm-mm. because if they do it by committee and they're all capable of it, and they'll be fine. Yeah, man, it's championship pedigree. Yeah, so relax. Relax. Yeah, I'm, I see it all. Relax. And then you know they get in. I, I'm in the Laker community on Bleacher Report, and I see and you get you get all these these uh, non Laker fans, the Clipper fans, and these brand new Brooklyn fans. They in there, and they they antagonize the Laker fans, and you know what? They 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 worry about them. And he, you know another thing, uh, my man from the Laker Nation. Um, Trevor Lane. Yeah. I loved I, I love Trevor Lane. I'm subscribed to him. I love him. But you know, he's such a fan that he's worried about what the Clippers doing and, and what the Nets Emotional. is gonna get. I could care less. We got we got the Anthony Davis and LeBron James. And that's the thing, when you got those two players, you don't gotta be in fantasy world. You, got, you don't need all of that. You wish don't... we can have this play with the thirty million dollar contract. <laughs> yeah. You got two of them already. Exactly. Two all world basketball players. And then you and you look at the pieces that you put around and now these pieces get a chance to to learn the system mm-hmm. to get better. So a- Anthony Davis know the system already. So when he come, it's just Continue doing what you've been doing. I'm really. just gonna, I'm just gonna plug right in, in right into this, mm-hmm. and make the game easier for you. Absolutely. So, I tell you, it's, it's, I, I, I think it's a blessing in disguise. Yeah, he's getting his rest much needed. That turnaround from the bubble. Yeah. And he's always had, you know, knickknack injuries throughout the course of his career. So now he gets an he opportunity might be to in just the best, chill well, and relax. Almost, uh, the best shape that he ever been in. Going at the end of the season, he and, will, he shouldn't be all bad, and he doesn't have to come back and carry the team either. Huh? That's also because beneficial. they know how to win without him, yeah. and that's going to be a great thing. That's what I, everybody just needs to relax. Just relax, 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 yeah. man. They're going to do it by committee. That's mm-hmm. what championship teams do. But even me and you need to relax sometimes because sometimes we be ready to choke Vogel with his with his with his lineups. You know, <laughs> that's valid. <laughs> yeah, I know, but you know what it is? He's filling it out. He's filling it out, and he's be like, I, I last year, this time we were ready to give KCP away. We was ready to give him away, and then oh, my got, boy, yeah, your boy. <laughs> when he got into the bubble, he was one of the biggest. He was the, he was the third piece that they need. Yeah, but what helped what helped him out was the fact that he got the reps. You looking at someone like. THT. I'm not saying he's an all star, but in some games you like, he should be out there. He can create well, off the dribble. I can understand what Vogel Vogel doing. I listen. In the in the playoffs, THT make a lot of mistakes. He does. Because I watch, and you know how I am with defense. He make a lot of wrong defensive rotations or, or lack of days of cool. Not up on a, a shooters mm-hmm. that you know they're gonna shoot. And he, you're backing up, giving them the three. That that's no good. But how you gonna learn unless you out there? Because yeah. Wesley Matthews makes a lot of mistakes too, but and that, he get the PT. But listen, this is exactly why I was saying, and I, I you probably want to jump over this table and choke <laughs> me. And the Laker fans, they probably gonna come over here and be like, yo, I'm not watching him anymore. <laughs> but I'm starting to think that it's a, like I said by committee, and Vogel keep going to him and just giving him confidence. The same thing. We thought that KCP should not be in the game. Every time he would come back in the game last year, we we were saying, oh, scrimping. But now, I believe that, I think that Matthews is, is KCP this year. I think he's going to turn around and... No, nah, you don't believe that. I believe that. Yeah. I don't believe he's going to be, you know, but I don't... I don't I don't think like, like he's gonna be some all of all of a sudden the third best man on the team. Right. I just think that he's gonna give them if he can help them win a a, a, a game or two in a, in the playoffs. He done his job. That's a fact. He just yeah. got to knock down that shot because he getting the easy ones. Just got to knock them down. That's what they pay him for. Yeah. I just, believe he will it, because I'm hoping he does because the, the simple fact that Vogel keep counting on him mm-hmm. and keep going to him. So he's letting them know he, he believe in him. LeBron made a statement that he believed that he can, they can win, they 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 can 
win with what they have if they made no no adjustments. He's he's satisfied with the team, and I don't think that he was just trying to be politically correct. Because when LeBron feel his team needs something, he said, he's a, I need playmakers. Well, he's wise enough to know that yeah. AD is not playing. And he already know that he ain't even at, I'm I'm not even playing at the level that I'm going to be playing at. Cools and stepped it up. And, and I'm not worried about all these other teams and what they picking up and all that. It's, it's only, you're going to put five people on the, on the floor at one time. Mm-hmm. And if you put all five of your, these these deep players that you can everybody can't score he know that why he, he played with chris bosh wade wait and and chris bosh had to take a back seat mm-hmm. so and then people thought that chris bosh wasn't good he had to play his role to win the game to, to be a winner so what are these other teams what 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 are these other teams gonna do are they gonna take their back seat Three people yeah. cannot score. They mature enough. They twenty five and thirty points a game. Nah, it's not nah, gonna work. Man, no. Yeah. So. So we don't need all these 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 pieces. We don't Just need relax. all of that. Relax. Yeah. yeah. Everything's looking good, man. Now, yeah. now Tucker, that's I would take him. Mm-hmm. That th- that's a realistic deal that could actually happen. Um, I'm not sitting around waiting for Drummond. I'm gonna I'm gonna first opportunity the right piece open up. I'm going to fill that spot. Whiteside, you'll take him as well. I'll take Whiteside, that, but that's I don't think they're going to buy out Whiteside. Mm-hmm. They feel they can get something for him because his contract is is a tradable Minimal, contract, yeah, yeah. and they're not using him anyway. Mm-hmm. It ain't going to make no difference anyway because Sacramento ain't making the playoffs. Mm-hmm. No. Lakers in a uh, good position, man. Relax, just, just relax, man. That's Do it by committee. In other words, just play team basketball. You'll be straight. LeBron is still out there. Uh, you, AD will be back soon. What three weeks, right? Yeah, yeah three weeks. Oh, maybe more. Uh, or maybe more. That's, that's fine. Back. As long yeah. as he get back before like twenty five games mm-hmm. in, I will be okay. Cools, like you said, is developing and coming along nicely. Mm-hmm. Still got Caruso, KCP. Is Dennis gonna, hasn't found his stride yet, but you can see it's coming. It's coming. Yeah, yeah. So just relax. Even, um, uh, even even um, Caruso, he's been banged up. Look. Don't rush him back. Let KCP him. has been banged up. Yeah, right. That's yeah. what I'm saying. These they, they just finished playing in the bubble. Mm-hmm. Of course, they're not going to be strong er, er, early in the season like this. They know. But, but watch when the playoffs. long game, man. Y'all let relax me, out there, let, man. Let me whisper it. Yeah. Watch when the playoffs start. That's when it matters. Yeah. Championship ball, man. Mm-hmm. Lakers doing it by committee. AD, he'll be back. But until then, they can get it done. And any... Piece that they pick up is going to be the right piece. It makes sense. And it's only going to enhance everything that we're talking about right now. Mm-hmm. And if that piece, if they don't get, because all these names, that, that, that they're not getting all of that. And they don't need all of that. And it's like starting all over, too. Some of the names you hear, some of it's not realistic, but you got to give up so much. It's like you're starting all over again. You don't have enough time to build enough chemistry no. to... to you give away half of your, your team, and now you're gonna you think you're going right in there. You, you're not going in and win no championship like that. It's fantasy basketball, man. Exactly. We, we nah, don't need it. Nah. So Los Angeles Lakers doing it by committee. By committee. By committee, man. Yes. God, that's all I gotta say, man. It's I'm a, a team sport. We know that. Right. Okay. And I still think that this is the best talented team that LeBron ever been on. Complete. From top to bottom, yeah. I'm right. rolling. They, I read an article that said that the Lakers have had all season ten practices. That should scare everyone. Ten practices. Ten. Oh, so they're just going off muscle memory. They, the game is their practice. Yeah. And think about all the new players that they brought in. Ten practices. Right, and that's why Schroeder's struggling because he can't get. He, he, he's saying that. Um, He's he. I keep wondering why he keeps saying I, I haven't got, I haven't figured it out yet. They don't practice, mm-hmm. and I don't blame them. They're banged up already, and and the way the, the way the 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 the, um, rec, the the schedule is, they're playing every other day. Back to backs too. Yeah. So what time do they have to practice and be able to rest to fix those all the, these bruises and stuff that they have? Mm-hmm. But when they get healthy, oh. What they call it, scary hours, right? That's yeah, it, scary yeah. hours. I mean, yeah. I don't have anything else to say. I just want you guys to 
I mean, I under, see, that's the thing here in team sports. I'm not putting up that clickbait. All the and working off the Laker fans' emotions, emotions yeah. with these with, with well, all the no. We want to talk real, realistic. And it's not fantasy. It's not um, NBA 2K. Mm-mm. No, 2K won't even allow some of that stuff to happen. You know yeah. what I mean? That but that people asking for. So stop with the nonsense. Keep it realistic. And if you're a real Laker fan, you you, you should know they're gonna come out. They're gonna be there when it comes time. Mm-hmm. Jeannie already said that she's willing to go over the cap. But everybody keep worrying about how much money we have. How, how much money you think she's going to go over the cap? I think realistic. Right. If the right person open up and I can, a buyout, mm-hmm. not a, not to trade away half my team, but a buyout like a drumming. Mm-hmm. So you, uh, uh, other teams have about $5 million to give him. We don't have that much. She's willing to match that five or six million to get him to come over there and pay that. Mm-hmm. She's gonna make it back off anyway. Yeah. The fans will be back in the building soon. You know it. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, that's it. That's all I gotta say. That's all I gotta say too, man. Yeah. Just relax, man. Mm-hmm. Take it easy. It's a marathon. They're the champions. Yeah. They're the champions for a reason. Mm-hmm. Ad Ad will be back soon. I'm not getting out of here without <laughs> without talking about Markeith Morris. It's another sleeper. Mm-hmm. I'm telling you. And I, and I love how Vogel is playing him. He's not overplaying him to wear him down because he mm. know he's going to need him in the playoffs. Mm. You watch. Watch. You ain't got to convince me. I know what's up. He's already starting to pick up his play because mm-hmm. it's that he's a veteran. He know what he's doing. Yeah. He'll be fine. They already are. Yes. So there you have it, man. This is Team Sports Entertainment, the podcast, your one-stop shop for mature sports dialogue. Forget, Don't forget to hit the like button. Leave a comment below. Subscribe to the channel, hit the notification bell, and Lakers Nation, just relax. Everything's going to work out. Promise. We out of here. Team Sports. Be good. Peace.